Hey, hola. Let me explain how to solve the exercise one. So you know that for every five tennis balls, you must use um, three tennis rackets, okay? So on the first exercise, you must write the ratio between tennis balls to tennis rackets. So in my last explanation, I told you that you can write the ratio as a fraction. So you can write five tennis balls on the top and three tennis rackets on the bottom. So you can write here five tennis balls and three tennis rackets. Okay, but also you can write it using the words using the word two. So you can write this as five, two, three. Okay? And even you can use the column symbol. Okay? So you can write like five, use the two points, three. So there are three different ways. You can write as a fraction, you can write it uh, using the words, or you can write using the column, okay? For the second exercise, or the second ratio, you must write the ratio between tennis balls uh, and the total pieces of tennis equipment. So again, if you know that you have five tennis balls and three tennis rackets, you know that you have eight items in total, okay? So on your second ratio, on your second ratio, you must write the ratio between tennis balls to total pieces. Okay? So you can write again as a fraction, you write three tennis ball, excuse me, five tennis balls, five tennis balls to eight, or even you can write in words, five to eight, or you can use the column symbol, five to eight, okay? So this is the exercise one on your assignment. So please try to take your time to understand this and to work on your exercise number two. If you have more questions, don't hesitate to write me. Bye, Ula.